I'm back in Brooklyn. Now I'm down in Brooklyn. Abigail Aguilar from Rizal National Science High School. Your tutor for today. And I'm going to show you how to determine the circle using its three conditions. Let's do this. Example, we will find the general equation which is x squared plus y squared plus dx plus ey plus f equals 0. Its center, the radius in points 2, 3, 3, 4, and negative 1, 2. We have to substitute all the values of x, y in the general equation at points 2, 3, 4 plus 9 plus 2d plus 3e plus f equals 0 is equals to 2d plus 3e plus f equals negative 13. This is your equation number 1. At 3 and 4, 9 plus 16 plus 3d plus 4e plus f equals 0 equals 3d plus 4e plus f equals negative 25. This is your equation number 2. And last, at points negative 1 and 2, 1 plus 4e minus d plus 2e plus f equals 0 equals negative d plus 2e plus f equals negative 5 is your equation number 3. Next, to obtain equation number 4, you have to combine equation 1 and your equation 2, which is 2d plus 3e plus f equals negative 13. Since you have to reduce the f, you will use the operation subtraction minus 3d plus 4e plus f equals negative 25. You will have negative d minus e equals 12. And this is your equation number 4. And next, to obtain equation number 5, you have to combine your equation number 2 and your equation number 3, which is 3d plus 4e plus f equals negative 25 minus negative d plus 2e plus f equals negative 5. You will have 4d plus 2e equals negative 20. And since all the terms is divisible by 2, you have to divide it by 2. And you will have 2d plus e equals negative 10. And this is your equation number 5. All your 5 terms, you can now have your d. From equation number 4 and equation number 5, you can now have d equals 2. Negative d minus e equals 12 plus negative d plus e equals negative 10. You will now can cancel e and you will have d equals 2. Since you obtain your d, d equals 2, you can now obtain your e also. But always remember that you can always obtain your e from equation number 4, which is negative d minus e equals 12. You have to substitute your d here. Negative 2 minus e equals 12. Negative e equals 12 plus 2. You will transpose negative 2 from the right side of the equation and you will change the sign. Negative e equals 14. Since you have negative here, you have to divide this whole equation by negative 1. e equals negative 14. Now, you have your d and your e. And you have to obtain your f. And you can obtain this from your three first equations. And I have choose equation number 3, which is negative d plus 2e plus f equals negative 5. And then, you will have, you, you have to substitute all the given values. Negative 2 plus 2 times negative 14 plus f equals negative 5. Negative 2 minus 28 plus f equals negative 5. Negative 30 plus f equals negative 5. F equals negative 5 plus 30, since you have to transpose your 30 in the right side of the equation. F equals 25. Center, negative 1 and 7. To obtain a radius, you can now have 1 plus 49, square this, square this, minus the constant, R equals square root of 25, since this is 50 minus 25. R is equals to 5. Now, you have completed all the conditions. You have your center, negative 1 and 7, the radius, 5, your D equals 2, E equals negative 14, F equals 25. Now you have your general equation. Substitute all the values. X squared plus Y squared plus 2X minus 14Y plus 25 equals 0.
you know how to determine a circle using three conditions. Thank you for watching. Yeah. Yeah, I'm out at Brooklyn. Now I'm down in Tribeca, right next to the Nero. But I'll be hood forever.